Lake Mead, the largest reservoir in the United States by capacity, has begun to show signs of a slow but steady recovery after hitting its lowest point of 1,054 feet above sea level earlier this summer. Since the end of July, the reservoir has gained approximately 1.5 feet of water, a modest increase that provides some relief to a lake that has been under extreme stress due to prolonged drought and rising water demand. This small gain comes primarily from upstream releases from Lake Powell, which continue to supply Lake Mead as part of the carefully managed Colorado River system. While the Bureau of Reclamation has not recently issued any official declarations regarding water releases, the movement of water from Powell to Mead is part of routine operations aimed at maintaining a balance between the reservoirs, supporting water supply for millions of people, and preserving hydropower generation. Despite this uptick, it is important to recognize that the water is not new, it is the same water being shifted between the two reservoirs, and Lake Mead remains far below full capacity. Meanwhile, Lake Powell is dropping rapidly, highlighting the ongoing challenges posed by the mega drought gripping the southwest. The discrepancy between the modest gains at Mead and the losses at Powell underscores the complexity of water management in the region, where every drop must be carefully allocated to serve cities, agriculture, and energy production. Experts caution against interpreting the small rise in Lake Mead as a full recovery, as long-term projections still indicate vulnerability to further declines if dry conditions persist. Nevertheless, the current increase demonstrates the effectiveness of coordinated water management strategies and provides a glimmer of hope that, with careful planning and continued conservation efforts, the reservoirs can be managed to mitigate the worst effects of ongoing water shortages. Four millions of people who rely on Lake Mead for drinking water, recreation, and electricity, even small gains in water levels are significant offering a reminder that deliberate action can make a difference in a system under intense pressure from climate change, drought, and growing demand.